Welcome back into Victoria's Tarot. Today we are going to check in with Nadia Cole. And I want to know what was going on with Nadia before she decided to ditch her family and go on the run with her now fugitive fiancé and his baby girl, Soraya. What was going on with Nadia when she decided to go on the run? Right along with her fugitive fiancé. Knight of Cups, a special invitation. Hmm, romantic invitation, romantic messages, maybe. We have the Ten of Swords coming up next, which talks about the ultimate betrayal. I understand how you could be getting betrayed right before you're about to go on and do whatever you're doing with your family. Who's betraying you right before you go? This Knight of Cups is this Aaron's energy. Seven of Cups in the reverse. This is like head out of the clouds. I'm realizing what's really going on here. That's the hidden influence. In the present moment, she's feeling betrayed. Before that, she gets this message from what I think is the lover boy, the player. The high priestess. Hidden knowledge. Ten of Cups. In the upright talks about the family, the happy family environment. This is, seems like family's around her when she decides to make her move. We have the two of wands in the reverse. In the upright, she would have been planning to go somewhere to leave home, but her plans were delayed. She's staying where she is because, as we know, she went to go meet up with homeboy to go on the run with the kid. That's the action she decided to take. The outcome of that, we have rest and recuperation. So hopefully she doesn't end up in the resting position. This kid doesn't end up in the resting position. And Aaron doesn't end up in the resting position. Everybody just return safe and sound. Get justice served. And be on about your business. Let's just hope that's what it is. People needing a break. But you went about it the wrong way. Because we're praying that nobody is being laid to rest in this situation going on with Nadia Cole before she decides to bail. Page of Swords. Now this message or this invite is looking like she's probably not comprehending too well what this is saying. Maybe it's not a clear message. Maybe she just don't understand it. Six of Pentacles. Here comes a fair exchange. Giving and receiving generosity. Is she feeling betrayed by somebody she was helping? Or does she feel like helping him is betraying somebody in some type of way? Did he betray her? Three of Swords and the Upright, the Heartbreak, Loss, and Separation. This is in the Hidden Influence. So it's like I realize something is going on and it's heartbreaking. King of Wands. Now, I don't know who this could be. Secret Knowledge. Maybe there's a man who knows something. not too sure about that king of wands but this could be somebody with secret knowledge about things that's going on four of cups or maybe she looks at Aaron as the king of wands I don't know four of cups in the upright so there's this person holding this cup of whatever in front of you on this beautiful picture platform and this person isn't paying absolutely any attention to this. They're not interested in this. And that's telling me that's the family not being aware of what's going on around them. At the time, she goes and runs off with the fugitive. Avoiding a sudden change with the tower in reverse for me. So she went with this guy to avoid a tower moment. If she didn't go, was it going to do something really bad to her or the kid? I don't know. I don't really know much about the case, except they're on the run with a kid. 
Page of Cups, Rest and Recuperation. So is this kid healing from something that happened? And you guys just ran with her to avoid people finding out? Did you need a break? I'm really not sure. Or maybe she needs a break from the kid in the end. This case is very confusing because I just don't understand. Bottom of the deck is the Nine of Pentacles. This is somebody needing help or this is somebody who not financially stable out there, right? So, of course, we know that's an issue with them. But this part right here is what's bothering me. This resting card in this Page of Cups, which tells us about a kid. So, as far as I can see, Nadia got a, a message that probably confused her or she just didn't understand the whole logic of it and when she did meet up with him there's some type of exchange and she's feeling betrayed she's realizing something isn't right and it's whatever it is is causing heartbreak so at this point i'm thinking nadia is out here on the strength of the kid maybe she just Sticking in there to make sure nothing happens to the kid. Like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.